Listen to this. Chapter 1. The Watch in the Attic Wickmere Bay was the kind of town where time didn't move. It drifted. I created this complete audiobook using just two simple AI tools, ChatGPT and Eleven Labs. And in this video, I'll show you how to do that from start to finish. So whether you want to create an entire audiobook using AI or just want high-quality narration to your existing PDF book, you'll find this tutorial helpful. You'll find links to all the tools used here in the description below. First, we need a story. And for that, we'll use ChatGPT. To begin, I asked ChatGPT for some audiobook story ideas. My prompt was simple. I want to create an audiobook and need a story idea. Can you suggest 10 story ideas? From the list it gave me, I found this one stood out. The Timekeeper's Granddaughter. Next, to turn this idea into a complete story, I typed. Give me the story based on this idea and pasted in the title. Just like that, it started generating a full narrative. Now, keep in mind, what you get at first might not be audiobook ready. The original output felt a bit flat. There were unnatural gaps, some formatting like headings, and no clear flow that a voice actor or an AI narrator could read smoothly. So, I gave ChatGPT more direction. I told them this was for an audiobook, so I needed natural narration, character dialogues, and smoother transitions between paragraphs. I also asked it to break the story into chapters instead of acts, which fits better for audiobooks in Eleven Labs. The result? Much better. A story that flows like a real book, complete with dialogue and chapter structure, ready to be narrated. Now, before you paste this into Eleven Labs and start generating audio, there are a few important tips to keep in mind. These small adjustments can make a huge difference in how natural and emotionally rich your audiobook sounds. The first thing to understand is expression, how the voice delivers each line. To get the right emotion, you need to guide the AI narrator just like a human voice actor. One of the best ways to do that is by adding pauses. Pauses make speech feel more realistic and help set the tone, whether it's suspense, hesitation, or emphasis. You can add them using tags like this. If you're not using tags, dashes or ellipses also work well for more subtle breaks in the flow. Another trick, capitalized words. When a word is in all caps, the AI gives it extra stress. That can make lines sound more intense. So, I went back and asked ChatGPT to update the script with all these elements, natural pauses, emotional emphasis, and a narrator-friendly rhythm. Now that I have my finalized script, I opened a new document to prepare it for narration. I added the audiobook title, a short introduction to set the scene, and then pasted in chapter 1. From here, the script is ready to be brought to life using Eleven Labs. But before uploading, I made one important formatting tweak. I combined the entire chapter into a single long paragraph. Why? Because when Eleven Labs reads the text, breaking it into separate lines can cause awkward, unnatural pauses between sentences. Keeping it as one paragraph helps maintain a smooth, continuous narration from start to finish. Once that's done, I save the document. Now let's head over to the Eleven Labs website. They also have a mobile app, but for this tutorial, I'm using the free version on their site, which gives around 10,000 credits per month. That's roughly one credit per character of text, so it's a great way to get started without spending anything. And if you already have a book written in PDF format, you can skip the writing part and upload it directly into Eleven Labs to turn it into an audiobook. Once you're on the dashboard, look for the audiobook feature. Click on it, and it will prompt you to upload your document. After uploading, you'll get the option to select your narrator's voice. For this example, I went with Liam, one of the built-in voice options. But here's something important you need to know. The default voices on Eleven Labs are widely used across various platforms, which means your audiobook might not sound unique. To make it stand out, 
It's better to use a custom voice, either one you've created using Eleven Lab's voice cloning feature or a unique AI voice designed specifically for your project. Keep in mind, you'll need at least the starter plan to access these features and gain commercial usage rights. It takes a moment to load, and there we go. I wanted to create a separate page where the title of the book and all the chapter names would be listed. So I simply copied the chapter to another page and left this page as it is with the title for a while. Now comes the next step, giving each dialogue its own voice. For example, when I reached a line spoken by the mother, I selected that text and clicked on the voices option. Eleven Labs showed a full list of voice choices, and I picked one that felt like it matched her tone. I did the same for the other characters. I chose a unique voice for Alara, then another for Grandpa, and to keep things organized, I named each voice after the character it belonged to. It just makes it easier to manage the project as you go. Once the voices were set, I played back the entire narration. Here, if something does not feel quite right, you have the option to adjust it. In this chapter's case, I think everything flows really well. From here, you can simply repeat the process for the next chapters. Free users are allowed only three active studio projects at a time. You might need to purchase a plan to continue processing further. Here, I also went back to ChatGPT to generate a list of chapter titles. It helped tie everything together on the first page of the audiobook. I also added a short paragraph about the author to give the project a more personalized feel. When it was time to export the finished version, Eleven Labs made that part simple. I downloaded the audio as an MP3. You can also choose to export each chapter separately or the entire book as one file. Finally, once your audiobook is complete, there are a few ways to share and monetize it. You can upload it to platforms like Findaway Voices, which helps distribute your audiobook to multiple major retailers. If you're planning to sell directly or run giveaways, BookFunnel is another great option. For creators in the US, Eleven Labs offers its own publishing program where you can earn around $1.1 for every 11 minutes of audio listened to. There's no upfront cost, and you keep full copyright ownership. And to boost up your discoverability and sales, make sure your metadata is on point. You can use ChatGPT to generate compelling book descriptions, select buy SAC codes, and even draft your marketing copy. And for the cover? GetIMG AI can help you generate the artwork. As for pricing, the creator plan offers higher audio quality and professional voice cloning, and it's still affordable at around $22 a month. But you can always try out the features using the link in the description. And for another useful AI tutorial, check out this video next.